Good afternoon. Uh, my name is Matt Divert, and I am the program manager for the Electrical Association of Philadelphia. This afternoon, I'm joined by my colleague, executive director and CEO, Sarah Hagee, as well as our presenters from ZLED. Today, we have President Ross Greenberg, marketing assistant, Patty Kirk, and inside sales, Gabe Feliciano. I'd like to thank Billows Electric Supply for sponsoring today's session with ZLED Lighting. Uh, before we get started, please note that because we are recording today's session, your camera and mics have been turned off. You are encouraged to ask questions using the chat feature and will facilitate Q&A after the presentation. It's now my pleasure to introduce our speakers from ZLED Lighting, Ross, Patty, and Gabe. Good afternoon, everybody. I uh, hope everybody's doing well. Um, so uh, uh, a couple of things. Number one, um, our company is ZLED Lighting. We're located, headquartered in Mount Laurel, New Jersey. Um, we have uh, uh, warehouse facilities in different areas of the country uh, and representatives throughout the United States. Um, uh, sales representatives, sorry. Um, so today, what we wanted to do uh, uh, with Billows Electric Supply um, sponsoring this, Billows uh, stocks and sells a lot of our Magnalumen product. Um, as uh, So what we wanted to do was kind of walk you through this product a little bit. I'm not sure if any of you have ever seen this product or used this product or know what it is. Um, so we're, we're going to kind of give you a, a, a pretty good overview of, of some of the different products and, and what's available. Um, I want to start by saying, so the product now that we're going to be showing you today, it's actually a couple of them, but um, the, the, the product name uh, is Magnalumen, um, M-A-G-N-I-L-U-M-E-N. -E um, so Magnalumen, we are right now, we're on the second generation, and the second generation we call Magnalumen Plus, um, and that's the standard retrofit kit. We're going to show you a couple other things uh, that, that we've designed with this kit. Um, but so Magnalumen Plus, uh, what it is, is, is it's, it's a magnetic retrofit kit. Um, and of course, there's a number of different magnetic retrofit kits throughout the country. Um, the majority of them use a uh, whatever size board it is, you know, two foot, three foot, four foot, five foot. But what they do, typically most manufacturers, they do it kind of the, the, the cheapest way to manufacture it, which is take a circuit board um, and put um, magnetic tape attach it to the bottom of the circuit board. Um, it's okay for a little while. Um, however, if anybody knows that's on this, knows anything about uh, uh, LEDs and chips and boards, uh, they tend to uh, get a little hot. When they get hot, what ends up happening is if you, if you have magnetic tape on the back of it, um, the, a couple of things, the magnetic tape could come off and, and most likely will come off. Um, and it also does not really allow for really good heat dissipation, which with LED is absolutely crucial uh, for, you know, for it to last the, the length of time that it needs, you know, that it's rated for. Now, Magnalumen Plus is rated at 100,000 hours. Um, you know, we underdrive the chips, so I, I, would, I would probably say that it would even last longer than that. Um, but because of uh, the driver spec and, and the, uh, the chip manufacturer spec, we, we have to list it at 100,000 hours, which is what they listed at, and DLC as, as well. Um, so what we've done um, with, with Magnalumen, I want to just take a, um, I just want to take a board off of here. Um, oh, yeah, sure. So. Um, hopefully everybody can 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 see this. Um, let me let me dim this light down just a just a hair might make it a little bit easier on on people. I hope that's okay. Um, so what you see right now is the the one of the bars with the cover on it. Now they all come with these covers on it. Um, you can get a clear cover. 
they all typically come with frosted. The reason that we do it that way is, you know, a lot of people don't like change, right? So they're so used to fluorescent lamps over the years and what those fluorescent lamps look like. So we wanted to design this so that was when it was in a fixture, whether it's exposed without a lens, like in a parabolic, um, uh, or if it's behind a lens, uh, like a prismatic lens, it would still really look like just a, a, a much thinner um, um, fluorescent lamp is what it would look like. Obviously, it operates differently. So that's the front of it. Now, a couple things. Um, that are really important. We talked about heat dissipation. You want a product to last. So what we've done is, and I'm gonna show you the back here and hopefully everybody can see this a little, um, but what we've done is, is we've designed a specific aluminum channel, okay? That the circuit board is actually sitting underneath the cover on this aluminum channel. Um, this channel, um, once this is inside of a trough or any type of metal fixture, um, it actually uses the entire fixture to help dissipate the heat, okay? Because it's on an aluminum channel. Now, the first generation that we had had snap-on magnets, which a lot of people have still. Um, this generation, which again, Magnalumin Plus, our second generation, has integral magnets, so you don't have to mess with that in the field it's already on here um let's say you get into a fixture uh for a lot of different reasons uh number one it might have been retrofitted before with an aluminum reflector well we all know that magnets aren't going to fit you know aren't going to aren't going to stick to an aluminum reflector so what we've done is we've created this um and i'm hoping hoping everybody can i i got it for a second um hopefully everybody can see this um uh, besides my face. Um, but what this is, is it's a little, like we call it a little foot here. So if you press this and just push it out, what it does is it exposes a hole here that the contractor can just tech screw into the fixture or into the reflector. Um, so, you know, that's, that's something that's, that's, that's pretty important. Uh, a lot of other manufacturers, even if they do make uh, a linear kit like this, Typically, what they'll do is they'll have a sorry, Patty. Uh, they'll have a very small little uh, metal piece that comes out the end uh, with a hole in it. Uh, they get damaged, they get broken all the time. So this design uh, really was was designed for uh, for the contractor for, for install. Um, good, good thing. Thanks, Patty. Um, so. I, I, a couple things uh, that that uh, we want to we want to talk about here. So um, on on well, do we want to do the, the the how about we do? We're going to show you uh, a, a really short, it's like a one minute video. Um, uh, bear with us. You know, just take a look at it, uh, and then we'll we'll come right back, run for a quick PowerPoint, and then uh, and then we'll just we'll we'll display these for you. We'll actually show you how they work and how they install. Okay. Hi, Magni Lumen. It's time to move on. I'm Maggie Plus and I'm the next generation called Magna Lumen Plus. Before I show you all the new features of Plus, here's a summary of the Magna Lumen product. I replace inefficient fluorescent and incandescent bulbs that cost a lot of money and waste energy. Here's how I work. You see, I'm magnetic. So I attach to your existing troffers fixtures in a snap. Just take off the ballast cover, disconnect the power, connect that power to my driver and plug me in. My driver magnetically attaches right to the fixture, and my LED strip lights do too. Oh, and see this thing? That's my light diffuser for those of you needing a more modest display of light. Of course, you can take it off if you want to. Now MagnaLumen Plus has many cool new features. MagnaLumen Plus delivers a 20% increase in lumen output per board versus my older brother. Our retail packs contain our CS case, which allowing you to select your color temperature. Look at me. Who 
brought the chips? We've got the dip. Just fooling. We do have a dip switch that now allows you to select your wattage. Our new onboard magnets and slide out feet make installation easy peasy. When you add these great new features to the original Magnalumen design, you have America's number one magnetic retrofit kit. Catch the Mag Plus Fever and contact my siblings to get more information at 800 679 9243. And on the plus side, go to our website for everything you need to know about the industry's leading magnetic retrofit kit. Well, thank you, everybody. I hope uh, you you enjoyed that uh, a real real quick video. We like to have fun with things a little bit sometimes. Um, so, what we're going to do next, Patty, if you could just bring up the um, uh, the, the um, there you go. Okay, so we're just gonna just gonna walk through this just real quick. I don't want to spend a lot of time on this. Um, uh, and then afterwards, if anybody has any questions, you'll 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 just let us know. Um, so on the first screen, you see Magnalumen Plus. Um, below that, you see another name, which is Magna Blend. That's another sample that we have here. Um, that as soon as we're done this slide presentation, we're gonna we're gonna show you what that product is. And um, hopefully, hopefully, you'll be pretty impressed. Uh, there, there's really nothing like it um, in the United States as of yet. Um, all right, so, you know, Magalumen Plus, um, it is the only color, temperature, and wattage selectable uh, retrofit kit in the United States with all the options that it has, and, and, and we're going to go through that um, a, a, as well. Um, uh, so, you know, what is Plus? Um, so, you know, typically it's up to about a 75% uh, uh, reduction in wattage um, when, you know, when you're taking out fluorescent. Um, it's a 20% increase in lumen output for, uh, versus the first generation. So, you know, I'm sure everybody, all of you deal with LEDs all the time. You know, lumens per watt, uh, what it was even a year ago to where it is today, um, you know, the chips, it's just, it's getting higher and higher and higher all the time, uh, which is very good, which, which, is, which is a good thing. Um, so we have um, enhanced product flexibility uh, with wattage and color temp uh, selectable options. Now, everybody knows that there, you know, most of the fixtures that are out there now, whether it's indoor or outdoor, they, most of them all have you know, wattage selectable, color selectable, I mean, that's like the new thing. However, you know, retrofit kits um, typically don't have that. Um, you know, and 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 if they have um, had it, uh, there there's been all sorts of issues throughout the industry with it. So you know, our engineering and our design on this product is absolutely phenomenal. Uh, again, we'll talk about it afterwards. But if if you haven't seen it um, um, or or used it before, uh, we will talk to you at the end. Uh, you know, if you need a sample, when you know, for, for just a, with a cord and plug or to show, or you need a couple samples for projects, uh, you'll just let us know, you, you know, and, and, and we'll be more than happy to get something out to you right away. Um, so uh, again, uh, build-in magnets uh, and uh, DLC rated. Um, so uh, wattages, right? So we, we have a wattage selectable driver. Now it's not one driver that covers all different wattages. So we, like we have a, a, a 10 watt, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, and a 100. And a, one, and a 100 watt. 100 watt you would typically use if you were doing like, uh, you know, four bars in a high bay in a warehouse. Um, the max uh, wattage per board um, is 25 watts. Yeah. Okay. So, um, again, and then the color temps, these, these are not the selectables, right? But the color temps are, that we have uh, for projects would be standard at 30K, 35, 40, 50, um, and we do a lot of 65K depending on, you know, we do a lot of body shops and yeah. things like that around the country where, you know, in paint booths, they, they use it and they love it. Um, we also have the different colors. Now, 
these colors, uh, just so you're aware, are the colored chips. So it's not like it's everybody else does a white chip or you know either a 30k, 40k, or 50k chip, and then they put different uh, uh, colored covers. Oh, they can't see this, right? On top of it, no. Okay, so. Um, and so we have all different colors and we also have black light. The black light uh, is, they are true black light chips on the board. Uh, so it, it, we do so many entertainment centers all over the world uh, with black light. Not many people have black light. Uh, we've been very, very successful with her. Uh, so the lumens right now, um, it's, it goes two ways, right? So uh, with, with, when you have the diffuser on, it's about 150 lumens per watt. You can take the diffusers off uh, because even when you have the diffusers off and you see them behind a lens, you're really not going to see the diodes. They're not gonna, it's not going to be glary. It's not going to stick out. But it does give you some extra lumens, especially if you're putting it out, say, in a warehouse in a high ceiling. Um, Standard voltage input, 120-277. Um, we do special order up to 347 if need be. Uh, CRI on Magdalene Plus uh, is, is as standard at 80 plus. Um, 90 plus, like it says, special order. Um, and we are gonna show you uh, some 90 that we have here. Uh, dimming is standard zero to 10 volt. Um, and the warranty on this product is at five years. Now, um, oh, I didn't even realize this was in here. Good. So the on the wattage selectable on the driver, uh, as you saw in the video, um, it's just dip switches is all it is. Now, we talked about different drivers. So you have a 20 watt driver. Now that 20 watt driver can actually go up to 22, but it also can be tuned down to eight watts and vice versa as you go all the way down, right? So the standard really, your 30 watt for offices are 30 watt and 40 watt, typically. So 30 watt, you know, you go up to 32 watts, but you can go down to 10, 40 watts, up to 42 and down to 24 um, and, and so forth and so on. Um, and then down at the bottom here, you'll notice that there's a maximum wattage per board, right? So like I said before, on the four foot, you're at 30 watts 30 per watts. board. So they have increased from the Magnolumen Gen 1 to Gen 2. Absolutely. Um, and then you see the three foot and, and, and two foot. Now, keep in mind, we have 16 inch boards, two foot, three foot, four foot, and five foot boards. Um, the reason that we have five foot boards is because we ran into a very large project in Philadelphia years ago um, where they had uh, some older Zumtobel fixtures, which actually had five foot tubes in it. So we went ahead to, you know, to uh, retrofit the job and sell the job. Uh, we manufactured five foot boards. Um, now, color temperature. On a job, on a project, you typically know what your color temperature is, okay? You know that if you're doing a job for a customer, you know it's 35K, 40K, 50K, uh, whatever it may be. So they can't see us, no? Okay, so we're gonna, sh we're gonna show you that retail pack in a minute. Um, so what it has is it has, as you can see, this switch. This switch, um, on the back of that switch, it actually is magnetic as well. So it just it just magnetizes uh, right inside the ballast cover of the uh, of, of the fixture, and you can switch the color temperatures. Again, that comes in the retail pack. So you know, for instance, um, you know, distributors they stock it, um, the retail packs, and we'll show you them in a minute. Um, and they have them at the counter areas, like you know, for instance, Billows um, has them at their counter areas, and you know. Contractors can just walk in, they can grab one because when they grab it, you know, they're grabbing typically either a two foot or a four foot kit. Uh, but either one of those uh, will have, you know, you know, the contractor may not necessarily know what color temperature he needs it for on a job. Um, so that's why the retail packs have it where you can uh, switch the, uh, the, the color temperatures. Uh, again, built in magnets. Uh, on the boards, on the driver, and on the uh, CCT switch, like we just mentioned. 
slide out feet, we already talked about that, um, on, onboard magnets, um, and then you could see on the bottom right there, um, you'll see that that's uh, one end of our driver. So you'll see that that's one magnet. There's actually two magnets um, on the driver. Um, I, you know, they hold very well. I mean, I wouldn't put it in a fixture and try to swing from it, but but they do really, uh, they they do really hold pretty well. Earth magnets. Uh, what's that? Earth magnets. Earth magnets. Thank you. So the other option that we have, and and it's not available in the retail packs, but it is on projects, um, is. You know, everything that we've done so far up to this point has been zero to 10 volt, right? But there are a lot of needs that different projects have where maybe it's not wired for zero to 10, right? So instead of, you know, rewiring, um, we have triac drivers that will work uh, with, with Magnolum. Um, okay, so this is what the retail pack looks like, uh, just, just to give you an idea. Um, and then uh, the kit, because it's white, it's a little bit washed out in the, in, the, uh, in, the, in the picture here. But what you see, everything that you see here um, is what you get. So, you know, typically you'll get two boards. I mean, it, it could be different, but depending on the kit you pick. But two boards, you have your driver. Um, you have your harnesses, um, which are all uh, plug and play, right? And then you also have in that kit, you have that uh, um, CCT switch as well. So that's how it comes, um, you know, and again, when, when you, it depends, everybody stocks different things. So if it's a higher ceiling, you know, they might, they might keep in stock a, uh, a four foot 50 watt driver, um, or for offices, a four, a four foot 40 watt driver or 30 watt driver. Uh, just so everybody understands, typically, except for the colored boards uh, and chips, um, these boards, so whether, whether you're going to put this four foot board on a, say, 20 watt driver, um, you, know, you, you can also, as, as you go up, meaning in wattage, if you need to go up, it's the same board. In other words, it's not different, it's not different boards. It's all about um, the, the power and the wattage of the driver, okay? Um, hopefully I didn't confuse you on this. So uh, Gabe, do you wanna do this one? Break yeah. it down. Yeah, so the part number breakdown is uh, MRK for Magnum and Retrofit Kit. Uh, the number three is the number of strips options, you know, you have one, two, three, or four. Uh, the length of the strips is the second number. Um, the the last two numbers where the 20 is, is wattage options. So you can, you know, depending on the kit, whether it's a 30 watt or a 40 watt, 50 watt, 60 watt, uh, that would decide the wattage of the kit you're, you're, you're ordering. Uh, the color temperature, obviously 40K in this particular situation. Uh, that'll be either 30, 35K, 40K, 50K, or CSK. Uh, plus for Magnum Plus, and then the RP for the retail pack. Now that's more of a of a, of a selection for uh, the distributors for retail packs and and and, and the job kit that uh, Ross was just explaining. But in a, in a in a in a job pack application, you wouldn't necessarily get a retail pack. You would just get the uh, the kit itself with the two bars plus the driver, or however many bars that you need plus the driver uh, in a dedicated color. Um, so uh, this is typically what uh, you know the distributors uh, like Billows uh, have have in their counter areas. So they would have the pop display uh, point of purchase, which is on the right hand side, which holds two foot and four foot kits. Um, and then uh, what we're what you saw on our conference table, which we're going to uh, show you in a second. Um, so that's the four foot working display. And what we did was we took like a one by four uh, wrap fixture. Um, we, we cut down the lens uh, so that you can, you know, whoever's coming in and looking at it uh, can also can see the bars behind the lens and, and then also, uh, you know, without uh, being behind the lens uh, as well. Um, so um, 
I'm going to just go through this pretty quickly. So we also, we want to take this game. Go ahead. Yeah, so the emergency backup kits with magnum bus boards. Um, so the BK kit is the easiest way, most versatile emergency backup kit. Um, how that works is you have your emergency driver. You can add additional uh, emergency drivers to the kits, uh, to, to the, either the existing kits or uh, you can order them uh, as, as kits. So you can order the emergency kits plus the drivers or you can add the emergency drivers to the existing bars. Uh, this kit will deliver over 2,000 lumens when you need it the most. Uh, this is a separately wired kit within the fixture. No need to be linked in with the existing driver. So uh, what that means is that um, you, this is virtually a standalone kit. You can, you can wire this one bar or two bar setup as an emergency uh, kit uh, by itself uh, in any fixture, any linear fixture, whether it's two foot, three foot, or four foot. Uh, kit comes in one or two, as I just said, in linear, linear LED bar setup with customer choices uh, between 35K, 40K, 50K, 65K. Um, mounting hardware whip and test button with the green charge indicators are there. So everything's included into the kit. You get everything you need all in that particular uh, kit. Uh, with the ability to be paired with any type of fixture, whether LED tubes or even a simple fluorescent fixture, um, solid 90 degree minute stream of light, always referred to national. So what that means is that uh, you could virtually add this Mercy kit to an existing fixture that already has fluorescent tubes in them or uh, 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 linear four foot, two foot LED tubes. Uh, so what this, you know, how, how it would work is that you, you lose power. Uh, this has a, a separate circuit tied to the fixture itself. Uh, you lose power, a power goes out and then our emergency kit plus uh, LED linear uh, bar will kick on. Uh, so it's, it's, a, it's a pretty nice feature for existing fixtures and, and everything's in stock as well. And I will tell you, um, it is probably, you're probably gonna find uh, that it's the, the least expensive um, emergency option uh, that's really available in the marketplace. Um, all right, so uh, move it on. Um, you want to go, through, go yeah ahead. so the BEK backup kit so this this is how the retail pack would come um it, you would have either your one or two bar two foot or four foot kit um now this only brings the emergency driver and the bars it doesn't include the uh mrk kit as well now you could add or you could order a, an mrk kit uh with an additional emergency driver if you wanted to but i just kind of want to explain that this particular kit alone only comes in either a one or two bar setup with the emergency driver only. Okay, so um, now we're, we're, we're just gonna run through MagnaBlend real quick and then we're gonna show you uh, some of the samples and then we'll open up for questions. Um, so MagnaBlend, um, what is, what is MagnaBlend? Uh, MagnaBlend is MagnaLumen, however, um, what we've done, um, and we started this out uh, for, for retail applications for national account, um, and it ended up moving into uh, schools. Um, so what we're actually doing is we are mixing two different color temperatures uh, on the same board, okay? Um, so um, what are our combinations, Gabe? Uh, 30K, 30, 40K and then uh, 30, 50K, Correct. Uh, all 90 CRI plus. Right, and we're gonna show you that in a minute so, so you'll get an idea. Um, now, why did we do this? For, okay, so we originally had a, a, a retail uh, customer, a very large retail customer came to us and, and, and said, hey, listen, you know, we, we've, we've got these showrooms um, where we have, you know, high-end paint, high-end wallpaper, uh, you know, all those things and we've tried every type of fluorescent we've tried every type of led that's out there we can't fake we can't figure it out we, we you know it just it doesn't look it doesn't look good what can you do so we got some samples of their wallpaper and we started playing around with it um, and we noticed that if you took two different color temperature boards and held them together 
and held them over top of some of the wallpaper samples, um, all of a sudden, uh, what took place was pretty amazing. Um, it, it actually, the wallpaper like, just like popped, um, was almost jumping off the table. Um, and, and, and we can always show that to you. Uh, so, so you understand, I'm not even exaggerating when I say that. Um, people say, you know, okay, so you got two different color temperatures on the same board. You know, why? Why do you do that? Because if you have a 3,000, Gabe, and you have a 5,000, typically what would people think? You have a four, right? Yeah, it would have a 40K, right? You would have a 40K. Yes or no. Um, really what it is, is you're getting the best of both worlds by us doing this, right? So you have the warmer color temperature that's picking up, you know, the browns, uh, the tans, you know, all those type of lighter colors. And then you have the higher color temperature, which, which is picking up, you know, the, the blues and all, all those colors. So when you have them both in there together, it's actually bringing out all those colors out of one board, all right? Now, that's retail. We also designed another um, Magda blend, right, which is what? Uh, 30K and 50K. I'm Combo. testing and he's still pretty good. Um, so um, he knows the stuff inside out. <laughs> so so um, what we did that for, we designed that really for, primarily for schools. Um, it can be used in other applications, but you know, there's white papers that are out there that talk about color temperatures and students um, and, and teachers, but you know, primarily students and, and their grades and what different color temperatures, you know, keep them more attentive. Um, so what we did was when you, in a classroom, when you put a little bit of a warmer color temperature and you put a colder temperature in there, it's kind of doing the same thing that it did in retail. However, the colder temperature, really what it's doing is it's, it's, it's keeping them uh, more weak, okay? Um, and, and, and the, you know, the warmer color temperature is, is at the same time, creating a, a, a relaxing, comfortable, comfortable atmosphere, um, which, which takes away a lot of the anxiety uh, that, that kids have in classrooms as well. So again, we're doing this on the same exact board. We're mixing every other chip. Um, I think, here you go. Thank so you. This, this is what we were uh, what we were just talking about, uh, and Gabe, you know, mentioned about the color temperatures. So you see the every other there, and that's exactly what we're doing with uh, with Magda Blend. Believe it or not, when you see it inside of a fixture, um, and you look up at it, you you can't tell that there's two different colored temperature chips um, that that are on the board. Um, Again, Magna Blend, um, you can see your different wattages here. You got 20 watts all the way up to 100 watt. Um, there's two different color blends, the 3040, the 3050. Um, again, 130 lumens per watt uh, with the frosted diffuser 150 without, uh, 12277 voltage. Um, output driver voltage on this is uh, 27 to 42 VDC. Now the CRI on this, on Magna Blend, is standard at 90, all right? And we're gonna show you that in a minute. Uh, we, we did that originally for two, two reasons. Number one is, you know, the higher CRI, the, the more clarity you have. Um, so, you know, it, it, it's much clearer, much crisper. Um, and, and that's important for both of those applications that we talked about. Uh, again, st uh, standard uh, zero to 10 volt dimming, um, your operating temperature is right there, has surge protection in there. Uh, it's rated at IP20. Um, again, warranty, five years. Uh, LM70 rating is at 100,000 hours. Um, just a couple different things here, just kind of showing you some pictures. Um, these are actual pictures that have Magna Blend uh, in the applications. Um, and, and when you look at it, you really can't, you really can't tell if you look at the fixture. Um, anybody who's in lighting, we, you know, first thing we do is look up, right? So, um, you know, we, we, when you look at the pictures, you won't notice it, but everything that's in that space 
is going to look completely different um, than, than what they've experienced before. Um, uh, Gabe, you want to run yeah, through this, this real quick? Yeah, this is cover. Kind of, we already did, sort of, but yeah. So this just covers up. So, uh, one of the things that I, I did notice is that, you know, I talked to a lot of contractors Absolutely. and what they tell me is that the 30K, you know, when they're putting in uh, flat panels, for an example, and they're all 30Ks, you know, kids are falling, right. falling, basically either getting tired or falling asleep. Uh, and then if they decide to do a 50K, you know, it just seems like the kids were getting headaches and it just seemed like a very uncomfortable, uh, you know, area to be in. So, you know, when we, when we decided to come out with the, uh, the 3050, it just like I like Ralph mentioned that, you know, it, it kept the kids more comfortable, but also a week at the same time. And uh, yeah, so we, we use them in the uh, either grocery stores, uh, offices, classrooms uh, and, you know, assembly areas where true color you know, rendering is really important. If you have any current projects um, or you know, something that's being designed now, um, and you want to try it, uh, let us know, you know, we'll, we'll get you out some samples and you can actually either put them in the space if you want to, or show it to a client. Um, it, it really, it makes such a huge difference. Um, and, um, and we have them available. Uh, so, you know, just let us know. Um, we, we, we've always believed that, uh, Samples, uh, sample cell projects. Again, so this is the end. You know, thank you uh, to the Electrical Association and Billows for doing this. Uh, you know, for sponsoring. Uh, Patty, if you could turn this off, we're just going to show them uh, real quick here. Uh, just some of the um, some of the uh, um, displays that we have. Uh, go ahead, Gabe. Which one do you have? There? So this one I have here is the uh, blend. the magma blend. Yeah. Yeah, let me, let me, I'm going to turn this light down a little bit. Um, did we have it off? <laughs> Actually, I think. Okay. Is there a dimmer on that one? Or yeah, no? yeah. So as you can tell, I mean, it dims down to even 0%. It dims down. It dims down to zero, yeah. Zero percent. Now, in, in the Magna Blend, bring, leave it up there, for, go up for a second, but a little bright, but, but um, you, you can see there, there's, um, both boards are in here. Mm -hmm. Okay, of the, of the mixes, um, there's one of, one of each in here. It's kind of hard to see. But you can definitely see the the color rendering between the two. This is a thirty fifty k. This is a thirty forty k. Right. And when you look at it from here, it's one thing. When you look at it from you know like behind the lens, you 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 can't tell any difference in the uh, in the colors of the diodes. Um, again, seeing is believing, right? Um, you know so. That's why we're talking to you about samples, uh, because it's so important. Um, you know, people, you know, salespeople especially, you know, to consider try to talk into anything, right? Um, what we do is we say seeing is believing. You know, you got to take a look at this kit, you know, we'll get your sample, um, and 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 play around with it, you know, try it because uh, you'll you'll see immediately that that what we're telling you. Um, is really the case, uh, and and it really is a phenomenal kit. Um, also, as Gabe can show you up there, um, so these are the harnesses that come with it, right? It might be easier since I went right. lit. Yeah. Um, so that's all plug and play. So besides being magnetic, everything just unplugs and plugs in together, makes it real, real simple for installation. We've had contractors that we've you know talked to our reps talk to our distributors have talked to and they said no 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 we only use led tubes no, we're not interested and no matter what we try we can't talk them into it um we say well let us send you a sample no 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 we're good we're good we we send them a sample anyway mm -hmm. so when we send them a sample they get the sample they take a look at it they install it they see like they just see dollar signs contractors because this installs so much faster than anything else in the marketplace. One thing I don't think that we mentioned, I don't think it was even on the slide is, so when you're retrofitting a fixture with Magna Lumen or Magna Blend, either one, um, let's say you have a four foot fixture, right? Let's say it's a two by four, for instance. Um, you're not, you, you can remove uh, the tombstones if you want to, but our boards are cut short enough that they actually install uh, very simply uh, magnetically 
right in between the tombstones. Okay, so you can leave them there. there. There's no sense in changing them out. A lot of times when you're doing a retrofit from fluorescent to LED tubes, um, you either have to deal with shunted or unshunted, mm -hmm. um, you know, tombstones, um, or even if you have the right tombstones in there, if they're older, uh, they might be brittle and they might be breaking. That's a lot more labor. This right in between the tombstones, boom, you're done. Everything is is uh, is magnetic mm -hmm. and very easy to use. So if you want to cut that one off yeah. for a second, and I'm gonna turn I'm gonna turn this one on here. Okay, so this uh, is is magnolumen. Um, I'm not sure what watt is. Is, is this a 30, 30, 30 watt? Yeah, I want to say 30 watt. Okay, so you can see how you can see how bright this is. Um, again, I'm going to show you some something interesting. So, you know, when people ask about install, typically, you know, you, you, we show them, you know, what the board looks like, whether it's lit or not lit. But here, here's your install. That's it. You're done. Okay. The driver, again, is also magnetic. Now, we have the driver, you know, hidden behind here. Um, uh, but I want to show you something else, too. So right now, we're set at 4,000 K, okay? I'm going to go, that's 35. That's kind of, that's four. And then that's 5,000. So again, on the, in, in, the, in the retail packs, you get a choice if you don't, which is a great option. You don't know, you don't know what you need on a job. We have contractors that literally stock these in their warehouses, um, obviously all bought through distribution, but they stock them. And the reason that they like to stock some of the retail packs is they're not doing a big job. Maybe they're just going out and, you know, uh, changing out a light for somebody. Um, and they don't know what the color temperature is. So if they have a retail pack with them, it's so easy because you can just switch your wattage and you can switch your color temperature and you're good to go. Mm -hmm. um, so again, the other thing is uh, zero to 10 volt uh, dimming. Um, and you can see as this dims completely off, which um, in the LED uh, world is, is, is pretty important, especially uh, with certain dimming systems, with controls, um, you really need it to, uh, to dim to off. Mm -hmm. um, so that is, uh, in, in a nutshell, that's Magnolumen. Um, Again, you know, even in four foot boards, you could do people do a four foot, you know, one bar, two bar, three bar, up to four bar. Mm -hmm. So there's so many different combinations. It, really, what this is is a solution provider for everybody. You can build your own kit, and that's what we do here daily. Well, great, Ross um, and Gabe and Patty. Uh, great presentation for yeah. sure. I'm, I know our attendees learned a lot. And we do have a question in the chat. Um, someone is curious if these, uh, if the uh, Magnum Lumen Plus um, is available for utility rebates. Absolutely. So um, our kits are uh, are DLC approved. Um, so that opens up the door. At basically, any utility. Um, you know, it, it, it's approved for rebates. Yes. Thank you so much for addressing that. Um, nothing else in the chat. No other uh, questions, really? No questions. So, no. I'm just, one, one of the, one of the one, I'm sorry. One of the ones that I, 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 I was that, that, that brought my attention to was that a lot of, a lot of, uh, eight foot channels are out there. And uh, people really don't have a good solution for them. So something like this, a four bar setup with a one 100 watt driver will take care of that. Um, I know we were just talking on the two foot and four foot two bar setup and one bar setup, but I didn't want to leave out the eight foot applications because I know that there's a lot of eight foot applications still out there. And, uh, you know, we can we can definitely this particular kit will or not this particular kit, but this uh, product could do a uh, four bar uh, one driver, eight foot application replacement as well. We also have the sensor if you want to mention. So the uh, we, we can also add uh, uh, daylight harvesting, motion, 
and ox sensors to these kits as well. Now those are separate, but uh, separate, I mean, as, as uh, you, you have to drill a hole, obviously add the sensor to the existing fixture, but we do offer sensors as well in, in case you don't see you know, enough of that information. We do actually have another question in chat. Um, are, are these products DLC 5.1 listed, the new yes. DLC? Yep. I said, yep. Yes. Awesome. Um, in addition, my mom's watching. Are, are these um, used, uh, available to be used in um, paper, tight. paper tights and cold mother applications? Absolutely. Absolutely. Listen. The colder the application, the better. I mean, we sell these to a lot of customers that 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 use them in freezers. Um, so so that's not an issue. Um, and what was the other? Um, oh, vapor types. Vapor types. Yeah. So absolutely. I mean, we you know we we Recognize. sell them. We sell the kits um, as they are, and we also sell the kits um, that are in, we install them in vapor type fixtures. Mm -hmm. So. Absolutely, yes. Thank you. I don't see any more questions in chat. So uh, it certainly looks like the Magnum Lumen Plus is quite an upgrade from the original system. Uh, quite a unique product, I think, with a lot of applications that will help our contractors and help them find the right solution for uh, their customers. So um, again, thanks to Ross, Gabe, and Patty for presenting today. I uh, especially want to thank Billows Electric Supply for sponsoring today's virtual trade talk. Um, we will be providing ZLED lighting contact information in case you have any questions about the Magnum Lumen Plus or looking for an ex a sample uh, to show to, uh, you know, uh, for a project. Um, we'll also provide a copy of the slide pre presentation, and we hope to have the video available for viewing early next week. Um, so, again, thanks, everyone, and um, have a great afternoon. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you, everyone.